finished unloading at this place, so we'll put the hammer down to Lawton, uh, Oklahoma. So hopefully we don't have too much traffic going through Tulsa today. So uh, we'll see how it goes. Look at this. That's the kind of areas that we have to go in sometimes to do a delivery. But I love it. It's beautiful. Look at them beautiful homes that they got down here, you know. I mean, all uh, built out of bricks and stuff like that. That must be some people that got quite a bit more money than I do. Otherwise, I wouldn't be driving this truck, I guess. Now look at that. That's, that's pretty nice. Just going through Oklahoma City right now. Look at that building there on the left that they call a bank. That bank must have a lot of money and it must be making a lot of money, you know. Got the Walmart here on the right. JC Penny here just straight ahead. You know? Nice big highway going through Oklahoma here, you know. We are on I-44 West right now. And it's already uh, 31 celsius here already that's about 87 fahrenheit it's supposed to go up to about 35 celsius which is about 93 fahrenheit here today so that's pretty warm for us you know we come up from the north where it's uh, a lot cooler already than what we got down here so this is actually pretty hot for us you know but no well we'll survive We're just coming into the town where we are going to be doing a, a trailer switch and I don't know if you can see that here on the right they have a huge military base down here it's all restricted down here but uh, yeah you know see the sign down there and everything so it's pretty pretty nice to see you know big military places you don't see very often so anyways we'll go down to our shipper and uh, We'll do our trailer switch and then uh, we are going to go back home to Steinbeck, Manitoba. Look at that. That is good gear. They got their own little, uh, eh, I don't know if you call it lake, but a little water puddle or whatever. But uh, yeah, so we're just uh, arriving at good years. This is our uh, customer where we are going to do our. Uh, trailer switch up so we got a big 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 facility down here safety is our family thing I guess so no oh. Have a look at this pink car over here. Now who would drive a pink car like that? All souped up and everything. Man, that, <laughs> that's interesting, eh? All right, just finished uh, switching our trailers down here. And now we are on our way back to Steinbeck, Manitoba. So pretty darn warm down here today but yeah well we are putting the hammer down home though, miles, so that's all that matters then turn right on Northwest we'll Cash be home uh, Sunday we got 1190 miles to go so alright we'll see you guys down the road be able to see this but here on the left hand side we got a big roller coaster we are in Oklahoma City right now Oklahoma we're just going to go to the uh, flying J just down the road here about half a mile down the road here and going to go fuel up or, or maybe we'll go to the love go one half mile take exit 137 any 120 second and then slide left in 0.2 miles well thank you We'll do that. We'll go fuel Take up. exit 137, any 120 second, and then slide left in 0.2 miles. And now we'll see how much we fuel today. I don't know. I know we don't really need to fuel up just yet, but uh, it's a lot cheaper down here than it is further north, so we're going to do that fuel up here. 
make sure we get cheaper diesel. Okay, just finished fueling up over here. So let's have a look how cheap this fuel is over here. I mean, that is pretty darn cheap. Up there, uh, further north, you would probably pay about 380 to 370 somewhere in that mark. But we fueled up for 125 gallons today. So and it cost us only $450. So that's pretty cheap. All right, we just uh, made it down to a Flying J here in Kansas. So we'll be spending the night over here. So this is where we are right now. And uh, it's almost dark here, so anyways we'll uh we'll spend the night here and uh, we'll see you guys tomorrow morning thanks for watching